Well, welcome back, everyone. We are the Board Gamers, and today we are going to be playing another battle report of Conan by Monolith Games. We in no way own Conan, but we are just doing a battle report. And behind the mighty box is Jesse. <laughs> and Jesse, who are you playing today? Conan. You're going to be playing Conan. Does he does he come with anything special? Uh, nope. His, well, just now, he sh now he just has a sword. Okay. So. Conan's sword. Oh, he has Conan's sword. Yeah. Okay. Oh, it's Conan's sword. Okay, yeah, so extra better. special. It's not just a sword. It is Conan's sword. And then we get sword. one of these awesome momentum uh, tokens from last game for winning. Yeah, that's because, yep, they're, they're one. And right next to him, the voice that is in the ethereal is Ryan. Hey. And who are you playing? Uh, Baylet. Okay, and what do you got? Uh, I have a, I just have a normal sword. Oh, she lost her spear. Yeah, yes. it's kind of disappointing. That spear was sweet. <laughs> and you also have a momentum for winning. Yep. But you do have something you didn't have last game. Yeah, I got, I brought my guards with me. All right, it's Not, a good day. I mean, I mean, I mean, Conan's the only guard I need. <laughs> yeah, but you, you guys got a serious downgrade. Uh, but last time you were piloting two characters each, and now, well, the other guys just decided to go get the cheeseburger or something. <laughs> Yeah, that's kind of disappointing. Not gonna lie. <laughs> yeah, no kidding, right? And it's, over here, we have our overlord, Chad. Hey there. Um, who is going to be... Uh, uh, actually, what do you got down here, my friend? Uh, I'd say a host of skeletons, but that's a serious overstatement. I have some skeletons, and then there are some mummies. Okay, skeletons and some mummies. Yep. All right, and without further ado, you're, uh, what is our scenario today? Mummies. So out of the first chapter, it's the fourth mission called A Glimpse Into the Dark. All right, let's hear it. Let's do it up. Cool. You guys ready? Yeah. Cool. All right. Uh, once the dust settles and the last throats are slit, Conan and Baylet discover the pirates have been hiding a secret. Within one of the huts, they find a concealed door embedded into the earthen, earthen floor. Excuse me. Baylet gives but a slight wave of her hand, and the nearest of her corsairs leans down to pry it open. Though he easily snaps the door from its hinges, hinges he hastily... Uh, his hasty obedience comes at a price. The Corsair recoils, grasping his hand and shrieking in pain. Within seconds, he falls to the ground and exhales a final shuddering breath. A wound on his palm tells them that the door was trapped with a poison barb. His lifeless corpse confirms that it was the most virulent poison and that they must proceed below with utmost caution. So the opening prompt for this game... With hair bristling and nerves alight, Conan proceeds down a stairwell no man has trod for a thousand years. Disturbing a time-lost tomb is not a decision he takes lightly, but his appetite for gold and the whims of his ivory-skinned lover <laughs> persuade him to search the unknown yes. depths for what treasures might await. With Baylet not ten feet behind him, flanked by two of her guards, his barbaric instincts are alert and ready for lurking horrors and deadly traps. Whatever horrors lie beyond will have to meet his steely thews. I didn't know that was a word. T-H-E-W-S. Anyway, whatever horrors lie beyond will have to meet his steely thews before reaching the soft flesh of his queen. As I step down on level ground, they find the chamber strangely illuminated by an uncanny radiance. Stones embedded in the ancient brick give off eldritch green light and reveal strange hieroglyphs of a language unknown to them. One symbol, however, stands out from the others, one Conan has glimpsed in the past. It is the sign of Jebel Sag, an ancient sig sigil from the age when man and beast spoke the same tongue. A quick look about the chamber reveals that the symbol is part of a motif. Images of animals, men, and more blasphemous devils adorn the walls and tell an unknown tale. However, a quick study of the hieroglyphs reveals a tantalizing truth. Somewhere within this tomb lies a skull, a relic that somehow connects to a hoard of unimaginable wealth located in the ancient ruins of Galsega. Conan and Baelit each utter a curse to their respective gods, Krom and Ishtar, but are interrupted by the sound of sudden movements from the chamber beyond. So, for winning the game, either Conan and Baelit must acquire the skull, uh, parenthesis use Zulthur's crown equipment card, and then exit back through the entrance of the crypt before the end of turn seven. Oh boy. Whichever hero possesses the skull <laughs> must be placed on the stairwell zone to exit. If the heroes are unable to achieve this objective, the overlord would then win. Okay. Ooh. So, seven um, turns again. What it sounds like, there's an optional text from this mission for those that are reading the Conan book. 
Um, to make an exceptionally long story short, we have agreed that uh, there's secret parameters for the Overlord in this mission, which we are enacting. Okay, so we are going to skip reading that because they won't know. If you have the book, follow along. Uh, set up. The game starts with the heroes' turn. Okay, the heroes start in the arrows areas. Excuse me, indicated on the setup diagram. So we have things set up correctly. Then there is a thing that says Overlord information only. Um, for if you guys are reading along on whatever hell page 16, it would be this section right here. Mm -hmm. um, so we're not going to read that. We're going to read the very last thing to read here. Note, the skull cannot be thrown, but may be passed or dropped. If the hero carrying the skull is killed, the skull is dropped in that hero's zone. So the suggested heroes we have done already. Um, so after set, and I think we have all the gems set up. So I think we can literally skip down. This is my board. Or, okay, cool, we'll do... So, here's the picture of the board for what it's worth. There are two reinforcement icons, two different denotions of skeletons, and then some mummies. So, quick question. Yep. The skull is out so we can see it. Is it one of those cards as well? Like so, to make an exceptionally long story short, okay, um, what I can tell you is I know where the skull is. It is in a chest. Okay. Okay. But I will not tell you, obviously, which chest it's in. Okay. Okay. But Favorite. it is a very specific one. Um, in fact, you just want to take a picture of the book here, and I can actually just point to it. So if here's the map and whatnot, this, uh, and I think uh, one of these here paragraphs says that this is where the... Uh, uh, skull is. Okay. Now there's some spicy events that I'll just read through real quick. I'll try to make this fast so, so that we can get to gameplay here. You guys have insider information. <laughs> they don't know. So my reinforcement icons you know give me access to three reinforcement points. Uh, this is where I can spawn them. Uh, also, one of the things I can use for these uh, these things is a spear trap. So virtually anywhere is a spear trap for me, any square, as long as I use uh, the, the reinforcement zones. And I can also use them to close two doors that you open. Because of that, we have to take a little bit more time. We have to go through doors. So the four door icons that are here, you guys have to, they are all considered locked. Okay. You guys will have to do a complex manipulation and roll two successes in order to open the doors. Okay. Now... Conan, can you confirm to me, because it's making a note here that you can use Wall Wrecker on these. Does your Conan oh. have Wall Wrecker? Uh, what's the, I, yeah. What's the I think so. Icon? I can only imagine since it's giving me a prompt for it in yeah. the game. Yeah, you have it. So I'll read it then. Uh, here's what the Wall Wrecker ability may also yeah, smash through the doors. <laughs> Once the doors are opened or smashed, they're removed from the board. That's when awesome. doors are removed from the Wall Wrecker, you do yes. not need to place opening tokens when they were smashed. I'm just going to blow through the not the previously removed <coughs> doors, maybe you replace from the Overlord. Yeah, so long story short, whether you unlock them or smash them, I apparently can still close them somehow, okay. even if you smash through them. The last, the last thing to go over for you guys is that all the chests as well are considered locked. Okay. Um, and again, you will have to do a complex manipulation um, equaling two successes. So um, there's four chests it looks like but there's four items but one of the chests oh this is why there is a one last chest icon that we need right here we need a fifth chest because there's four items in the skull so. how you feeling guys oh so there's a, oh God. there's actually another chest so we have to break down that right door here to check yep. that oh ah. that's not a chest but we're gonna call it that it is. that's fine oh, it looks it. it looks like one doesn't it I or is that a crate? It's a crate. That's a crate. <laughs> there we go. There's a chest. There we go. Okay. Now you guys can't be mad at us online. We have. <laughs> and we, do, we do, in fact, have five chests. Chests. Yep. Yeah. Well, let's be honest. You were never going to do a complex manipulation to open a door anyway. Oh, no. Oh, no. I smash, <laughs> if we can <laughs> smash through the chest. If, if, just, no. If, I know. If, if, um, if we can wall wrecker it, we're going to wall wrecker it. <laughs> so, long, long story short, the last thing we have to read, and then we will finally get to gameplay here. If the heroes win, um, they remain strong in, for the next battle. Each hero still alive at the end of the scenario receives one momentum token, uh, indicative, I think, to the last mission. Mm -hmm. If I, if the Overlord is victorious, they will gain one additional stamina gem for the total during the next game. This means that the Overlord brings Women of the Mist with 13 
Okay, so whatever the next mission, I get something extra special, but we're not going to worry about, we'll about that next time we set it up. So that's the long and short of it. So you guys are trying to find this skull, and yeah. you want to get back to the stairwell from whence you came, okay? Do you have anything that's good at opening chests? So, yeah. um, I think that Just, brings you don't us have any ability or anything to your guys' no. okay. Okay. first no, turn. We turn left, one, we left fingers, seven turns, left correct. fingers upstairs. Yeah. How much for the chest? One success? Two. Two yep. for those as well. Yep. Complex Dang. manipulation, two All right. successes. All right. What health are on? The oh, there's no big boys in this one. Okay. Cool. All right. Conan! Go get him, boy. Uh, yeah, we're going <laughs> to... We're gonna wall. Oh, well, so everyone's going active, right? Yeah. Oh, yeah. So you Sorry, get your, yeah, get your two cubes. cubes. Yep. 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 Uh, we're gonna wall wrecker and use my free two movement to move first to roll. Do I have to roll anything? Because you're currently not at the door. Oh, this. Oh, that's a spot. I see. No. Wait. Oh, okay. So move one, and then okay. pay an extra one. So an extra two, right? And two movement. Yeah, points so to pay move X. across a wall from one area adjacent. Yeah. You'll have to pay an extra one. I did. Yep. Boom. Wreck it. Go on here. Kaboom. Because I have two movement. Yeah, but you used your movement to get to that space, right? Right. So I have one left over. Oh, I see. Yeah. You do it at the same time. Yeah. I see. Never mind. Does this apologies. totally get destroyed? or is it, it doesn't matter. Well, you said you can close them. Right. And then I said I get, no matter if they're destroyed. Oh, I, I okay. Always, I, okay. So apparently I'll set it here. That's why I was saying it doesn't make a lot of sense, but somehow I get to use magic and apparently recraft doors. Okay. Destroy. Oh, that works. That's fine. So are there multiple spots in this room too? Yes. So here's one, two, three zones. So I come into here first then. Yeah. I'm yes. Guessing. Okay. Yep. You want to oh, and I, I, I uh, for our viewers, I made a mistake the last game. Uh, I thought when it said that a tile was occupied, you can attack an adjacent tile. What the wording occupied means is if no one else can get inside. Oh, so I have so, to move in. So you do have to move in. Okay. It's if it's past, then say. you that can makes, get in. I was, gonna say I was just confused sense. by the word occupied. Friends. I'm then going to spend an extra one. So I'm spending two. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Well, I have two to move because I want to do all my movement in. I know, but isn't five the max we can put in a square? How many can, what's the max that it's goes It's as many in? as you can fit wholly within. Yeah. Yeah. It's okay. Oh, I was going to say, we just jam the guards in there and then you could attack anyway. You could do that. Okay. Yeah. I don't think that, I think they have to activate first though. How big is this square? That's the question. Oh, it's pretty sizable. Yeah. You're gonna be, yeah. You're going to be at least six people in there. Yeah. I don't know. I'm going to just go in there and kill yeah. them. Yeah. <laughs> you're going to follow uh, Here, I'll don't just, don't, I'll don't attack yet. I need to get over there. I know. That's what I said. Are you gonna follow? Oh, yeah, yeah. We're okay. gonna work. So one, one two, two, three. I think we gotta do one extra, right? Yeah. We're slow. Yeah. Following up. And then uh, going in. And then uh, let's bash. Yeah. And then we'll bring our boys with us. Oh, that's fair. How much was their speed? Three. Now, Ryan, if you activate them, you have to do everything on. Oh, they're fighting. Yep. So he, Ryan, actually, will have to go first then. Cool. So, what's the stats on those skellies? Nothing. They move two, they have no armor, they have a single health, and they roll a single orange dice. Oh, wow. Okay. So you got two re-rollable. We're just going to do both guards. Yeah. Boom. Uh, and you got to re-roll now. Re-roll. Oh, my gosh. One. Awkwardly. One single One. hit, huh? It is me. <laughs> I mean, this is tradition. This is tradition. <laughs> I mean, we don't break tradition around Yeah. Here. I mean, yeah, why not? I'll roll, I'll roll a single why dice not? for crepe's sake. Why not? And you get orange. Yep. Yep. So. Top on. Blocked. Dang. Kick. Guard you're, was unable to do so it. So there's three you're of fired. Them, no armor. He still got another guy. That was one. That was one. Oh, that was both. Yeah, they only have one attack. Yeah. Bail it needs new guards. <laughs> so I think what I'm going to do. Yeah, give me back fingers. I want fingers back. Because there's three of them. No armor. Does he still have the cascading damage excess? Yeah. Yeah. Yep. He always has that mm -hmm. on this character card. I don't, is there a, there's a young that one? He's got it on that one, too. Yeah. I think, oh, they, I, think I believe almost all of them have. Okay. Got all of them. I'm yeah. going to pay two into my attack and gain an extra red. So that's what I'm going to do. I bet you get re rolls. Huh? You get a re roll. Yeah. I want to see if I get your, your queen. Ah, I'm your, good. I'll take five. Your queen is here. No, oh, wait. You, you, oh, get, yeah. you get a free one. For you, free. Yeah. Okay, oh, there we go. Oh, uh, seven. Geez. Jesse, that's meaty. <laughs> <laughs> I 
Uh, yeah, we'll let him die. Yeah, he didn't suck in his lip. That usually means that the decision's pretty easy. <laughs> <laughs> he didn't suck in his lip. Hey, that's what happens. What you know? square is this thing in? Can we hit it from... Do you have to be on top of it? Or do you just have to be adjacent? kind of looks like it's in the middle. Oh, what's that it is in the middle yep that is a separate space oh it is so we have yeah. to go to that space separately yeah. oh okay my apologies I didn't... It's no gonna... it's all good it's kind of gross well i could move another two with conan you want to you want to go get those other yeah, yeah. yeah. Let's go, let's go kill two are you coming with yeah okay <laughs> Bailing. Just storm in, and blow blow the skeletons to pieces. We're gonna do the same thing. So two reds, no yep, orange. Here we go. With Take money. money. And we'll re-roll. Ah, oh, four. Okay, four. What's it gonna be, Chad? That's actually. I think I'll roll. You four total. Yes. That's correct. Four total, huh? Thinking about saving those? No, actually, because as it currently stands, I don't think I really have anything to do. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to roll three. I don't think there's much for me to actually do on my turn. Um, that's Fuck pretty one. awkward. Do they all die anyway? Yeah. They sure do. <laughs> my, Splash. My hero. <laughs> no. <laughs> Just no. <laughs> Says the bearded you, man in the cap. <laughs> do you want to move onto the chest and try to... Yeah. Okay, let's do it. So you have to spend another... Ryan, if you do that, you know you have to twiddle your fingers. <laughs> 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 uh, I mean, it's you, tradition. You, we need two successes, right? Yeah. Do you get a reroll on this or just attacks? Uh, I don't give the reroll to myself. Right, you don't. Oh, yeah, I'm, I'm others, Jesse. I'm the star. Oh god. Yeah. Oh, now that breaks with tradition. <laughs> that does. So, um, this is one that does not have the skull. Okay. No so. way. I'm surprised. <gasps> oh, you got some knives. Yep. Hawken. Yep, I got I got I got some throwing knives. Actually, Shavantis came in here, dropped the throwing knives in there, and ran out. At some point, <laughs> if you would like to pass them over, I have a... Yeah, yeah. Cool no, they're all yours. I'll go. We'll get there. Um, I think I'm done, man. I, I'm done I don't too. have a... I spent a lot of the movement yeah. in my attack. Interesting. Okay. Cool. So, yeah. Okay, cool. Uh, so, bottom of turn one. Uh, mine's uh, quite a bit easy, actually. So, I'm going to be getting back four, a.k.a. the spent ones. Um, my turn is uh, radically easy. So um, both my squads of skeletons are taken out, so I can't do anything with them, nor can I reinforce. Um, so I will simply pay a gem. Uh, and do... Just going to spike us. Uh, I will. <laughs> I will do a spear trap. So I choose a follower slash minion or a single hero. Um, as you can imagine, I'm going to choose Bailet. There you go. Uh, oh. I'm going to roll, <laughs> roll yes! two orange dice. I can use re-rolls uh, should I want to. I'm going to choose to use one. One. Yeah. There we go. Uh, two, so huh? two damage total, and you count this as a melee attack for what it's worth. And he gets re-rolls if he has it. I'm just double-checking. Yeah, he gets to use every single... Can we get two yellow? Because he's probably going to need... I don't know if you want to do an extra... No, yeah, just the one. Oh, I have to. Yeah, yeah, I have to do one. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yep. How much was it? Uh, just two. Two successes. J just two. <laughs> Come on, yellows. Just two. He's in Come trouble. on. He's in trouble. There no, he's is. not. Look at Black Ryan. with a sword. This is wrong. All right, this is very we're wrong. About, we're about out of uh, <laughs> We're about out of gas. I know. Oh, for my, uh, oh, for my, second, of uh, my second of two activations, you, you guys can spike do? me again. I am going to absolutely spike you again. <laughs> <laughs> Oh. Um, and I'll actually just keep it. It's just going to be another two. Two. Well. I want to use momentum, or are you going to... I don't know what no. that does. It, you basically get to a, a do one the use, action for free. A oh, one-use like, only gem. It's, it's like you have to spend this, though. And I would save this. Oh, this no, just, I'll just do that. Okay. Two damage? Yeah. Cool. cool. Uh, and then that's going to end my turn. So now this is going to go on to top of two. Okay. Top heroes, turn two. And so, I have uh, one singular gem available. Just definitely. Oof. Dude, I'm thinking about resting this turn. Yeah. Guys resting? Yeah. Yeah. Ah, that is a quick turn. Uh, Bailet's guards, are they resting? 
Well, I suppose Bailin is, so that doesn't matter. All right. So I just want to confirm that's my turn, correct? Mm -hmm. yep. Yes. Okay. All right, cool. Bottom of turn two, then. Do they count as dead for our charts? No. Okay. They're allies. Too bad. Oh, yeah. Um, they actually just don't help us at all. So I only... I <laughs> Trash. So, actually, well, they can okay. bodyguard for you for that spike. Uh, yeah. I will... Yeah, we're going to have to have them be a little bit more... I will pay a single gem to activate the mummies. Um, who move two? Oh, geez, these guys are kind of pissed, actually. Um, oh, they're mummies. Yeah, yeah. I, I mean, I can handle skeletons, but I don't do mummies. <laughs> um, so I will just simply move a mummy and a mummy. Cool. All right, Conan. And okay. then that's going to be the end of my turn. I won't activate anything later. We're just going to keep it... I could, use, the word. I could do three. I'm really, I'm really wondering <laughs> how awkward that is. Thing. Actually, you know what? Regardless, we're going to try this. We're going to push my luck maybe a little bit. I'm going to spend three cubes. Oh, boy. Oh, wow. And I'm going to do another okay. gonna reinforcement, and I'm going to try to spear bail it again. Stop. Yeah, we need to keep the little Stop. on you, man. Uh, I'm going to spend Ooh. my last oh, gem, wow. and I'm going to do a reroll. Yeah, that's right. You do that reroll. Oh, so, three. Three damage. All right, come on. Do that same roll, buddy. <gasps> well, you get to reroll one of them. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. You're going to reroll one more and then doing Oh, no, I get to reroll one just straight up. Yeah, but you can do them at the same time. You can do them at the same time. Yeah, mine's yeah, all. Dual rolls at it. Oh. Well, you blocked one. Ow. Taking two. Okay, we need to keep those guards on you. This sucks. <laughs> yeah, he's going he's to kill Bail it. Yep. Yeah. Um, and then that will be my turn. So I think this put actually pushes us to top of three. Okay, cool. I am active. Boom. Go get them. You get two back. You get to bring yours back and then. Are you staying active as well, Bailey? Yeah. Okay. Hospital. Yeah, we need to get some stuff. Okay. Um, I'm going to activate. He has no. I have zero no active gems. gems. Yeah. What's their armor? Three. Holy shit. How much health? Two? One. Oh. Uh, yeah, they don't. Uh, nothing's listed as. There's no health yep, counter. They said one. Oh, wow. Go in there and murder them. Okay. Let me just make sure. Okay, so we're in this spot. I'm going to spend both my movement to blow this door down and then move to an adjacent spot on the other side. And three armor. Huh? Not much subtlety in this. You should board. let me move over there. Yeah. You got to move your other chicas too. Hold on. You should keep them. I got to activate them. Oh, okay. I haven't activated them yet. Oh, okay. I was going to say, yeah, you're going to have to move. Can they get there? Looks yeah. like it. One, one two, two, three. Yeah. Three. Now here's a real question. Do you want to spend an extra so one? They moved in. Mm -hmm. Wait, oh, they just there. Because it goes to. No, it goes on the card. I think. Yep. Just one goes on the card. Yep. yep. Well, it's not what the sheet said. Oh really? Yeah. No, oh it, no, it just said put it into your. Oh really? Put okay. it from your reserve to your oh. fatigue. Oh, that's okay. right, you can do it once. Yeah. I mean, it's functionally it's the same thing. It's just showing that you, you've you clocked yeah. them. For the All right, well, they're just going to yeah. attack because yeah, it's true. their turn. Mommy time. Oh, <laughs> shit. Ryan. Okay, uh, you replaced your guards. So, yeah. Dude, they got that mummy. Interesting. <laughs> okay. Very interesting. So the mummy goes down. Mm -hmm. What a um, bad plan. I'm going to spend another movement. And I am going to go here. You don't have to follow me. Stay with your... Your yeah, cheek is. The guard's got to stay with me. Uh, with the phraseology in that is I'm assuming that they have some sort of body. Yeah. Yeah, they need yeah. to take the hit for me. Yep, that's what I figured. Um, so I'm going to spend two in a, uh, into one attack. So three dice. Uh, not re-rolling any of them. Right, well, no free re-rolls. There it is. Five. Okay. Wow. That's a very dead mummy. Um, I will then move... Go to the far one. Maybe. This one? Yeah. Okay. And we will try a complex manipulation. A two? Yep. We need a two. Here we go. There we go. Got a three. Okay. It is not where the skull is at. Yeah, it's got to be in the middle. Dude, you got the bomb. You got a bomb. Explosive orb. Okay. Um, yeah, I kind of want to stay where I'm at. Yeah, it's probably not a bad idea. Ryan still has some cubes left, huh? But 
his friends are in this square. So that's kind of a tough. Yeah, I think we just chill. You chill for a turn? I think we chill. Okay. Yep. Cool. All right, here we cool. go. Uh, bottom of turn three. <clears throat> Um, I will pay three and activate this. Trap time. And I'm going to try to spear, uh, which, uh, which one, uh, what rule do they have? They have bodyguard or whatever? No, they have sacrifice. What does that say? When a friendly character in this character's area is attacked, before dice are rolled, this character may choose to be attacked instead. The character connect guard for that defense. Um, I don't believe they have any kind of guard at all anyway. So, oh, you, you could do the overlord thing where you spend a cu uh, cube and you give him an orange dice. Oh, you can do exactly what Chad's doing. Um, and you have one armor, which is kind of cool. Yeah, so the it doesn't sound like they will get to do anything against my spear trap. You get to defend as if it's a melee attack, but I simply choose a character and just roll dice to do damage. Okay, yep. so I'm gonna be I will be doing this on Bailey. Um, I will use my, my last cube for a reroll. Three. So three coming in again. I can do that, right? Yeah. Big money. Is it three? I, I put two in there. Yep. There you go. Okay. There you go. Stopped. Uh, so that will be the end of my uh, turn. Uh, I won't do a second activation, and so this will bring us to the start of turn four. You know, for someone that rolls so bad, you're doing pretty good this time. <laughs> I'll stay active. Me too. Okay. Um, I'm going to move. Okay. Uh, since I can move two, do you want me to go to this one? Uh, and then, and then why don't, why don't you let me go and open oh, it? Oh, okay. Yeah. Go ahead. Just remember that your all your movement gets soaked up. That's why you got you kind of want to spend the two right away. So I was saying, if you want to go to the middle one, it's only one away for him anyway. Oh, it is. Yeah. Okay. You know, maybe. Thinking? Maybe you try to find the, the skull, and then we do a little handoff, and then. Uh, okay. And then I piece out of there. Okay. So, uh, you bail. <laughs> it's mine. The one, yep. I, I think it's there. It's got to be. And then we'll throw two. If it matters, flex. there is a sarcophagus in that. Oh, that would be good to know. Do it. There you go. Cool. So uh, as you can imagine, it is there. Cool. Okay. So now we have to pause. Okay. okay. <clears throat> All right, time to go. <laughs> this is going to get interesting. All right, so um, realistically, I'm yeah, gonna have front to find three smart. right there. Yep. All right. I don't and like. I don't like your what you're doing. Flip back over. Yep. Oh, we should have rested. <laughs> dun dun dun. <laughs> just, just give me the skull, Jesse. Anyone want to do an Ad Admiral Akbar? <laughs> it's a trap. <laughs> <laughs> so one of each color skeleton and a uh, I need another tile. Oh, wow. Where is uh where is this one hidden? His tile for the bone giant. Uh, right in that. It's, uh, you'll see a face up. Yep, right there. We've got uh, a bone golem and uh, two more skeletons to refresh his tracker. How did we not see that when we went through that room? <laughs> <laughs> They're behind us. So long They're story gone. short, this uh, Ryan, uh, magic. Dude, dude, these bodyguards, man. This bone golem <clears throat> is going to have six health. Is it ornery? He rolls three reds. He uh, I believe he also has wall wrecker. I'm dead. And then does. whatever uh, <laughs> whatever this spicy thing is, horror. The exer oh, the exertion limit. Oh, because you get one of each color you can put. What is an exertion there? limit? Is that the maximum number of, uh... okay. Cubes. Yeah. So uh, the Thanks. your maximum that you can ever do for an attack, a ranged attack. Yeah, that's the, the exertion limit of melee attack, ranged attack, move and manipulation actions of enemy characters in this character's area is two. Oh. So if you ever go in combat or in the square with the bone golem, Whatever the numbers are for your maximum number of dice, it changes down to two. Okay. Okay. Wow. 
Um, and so now, uh, turn just keeps going. So now they proc and they exist. And then now the game, that's, that was the big secret of this game. Got you. That bad boy's got a bunch of armor, right? He's got two armor and no. six health and he actually moves faster. He moves three and not two. And if I didn't say this already, he rolls three reds. He's faster than we are. <laughs> <laughs> well, what if I spend, oh God, I got a rest, man. Well, I, yeah, I mean, it's, I know. Yeah, I'm trying to figure out what best to do here. Because on his turn, he's going to reinforce on those points. And that's going to suck. What if we all just move into this? And then sit there and chill. And let them come to us. Move into where, Jesse? Into this square. Into that square? That's what I say. You want to try it? Or we could just move into the square where I'm in already. Yeah, but then we're closer to the golem. I mean, you can go through the wall anyway. It doesn't matter if the door's there. He has to spend movement to do it, though. He's got to spend two movement to bust down that door. Yeah, but when you bust it down, then you don't. You go through the oh, next spot. So he's yeah. going to be in, in, in range. Okay, right? I'm going to spend one and move into your square, then. Yeah. That way I don't have to spend a, uh, a cube on... Uh, That's fair. ...on activating my dudes. Now, you guys were talking earlier about potentially handing off the skull. I just want to confirm. Yeah, so where I can is drop the skull? it... I can or, drop it for free, right? If I want. Yeah. Yep. Okay. Do you want to pick it up? He's like, I'm going to die. <laughs> Do you realize that they're not going to attack you first, right? Well, you know what? <laughs> <laughs> What's the range on this? For what? For explosive orb. Oh, it's I, just like any other range. Can I drop attack? this no. and have you huck it? Why don't you just throw it, man? Because I don't have enough... Oh, yeah. It's just number of successes. Because yeah, that's a thrown item. Yeah. That's not a... It's two. We'd have to get two successes to yeah. get it, I think, right? Yep. Oh, currently, you guys can't see. Baylor would have to move. Yeah. Oh, yeah, because the line of sight tokens. Yep. Yeah, that, they don't connect. So you'd only need one success anyway, but you would have to move. I think we just don't worry about that. Okay. Well, you want to take this or no? I can hold on to it too. Yeah, you're hurt. <laughs> okay, I'll hold on to it. Okay, that's our turn, I think. I just want to confirm, is that 100%? The only other option we got here is I send my boys in. I kind of want my boys, though. <laughs> How far do the skeletons move to? Yep. Yeah. Okay, that's fine. Yep. Confirm done for the heroes? Donezo. All right, so the end of turn four. Oh boy. Uh, we're going to do a couple of things here. Yep. This is about to get scary. Let's. Um, I think there's. This a, could have all been avoided if we just didn't go down those stairs. I think uh, there's a couple of ways but to do this. Gold, Ryan. <laughs> You're like, oh. it ain't worth it. We didn't even get any gold. So, we got a skull. I'm going to pay. Yeah, we got some <laughs> knives. Come on, something. man. I'm going to pay uh, three gems. I'm gonna activate uh, the reinforce the the raven here on the first thing. Uh, I'm going to uh, as much as I'd love to do another spear. I'm actually not going yep, to. I'm gonna bring back. I have a reinforcement of three, so I'm gonna bring back three red skeletons. Um, right here. That's a big deal. And then I will pay one, and I will activate red skeletons. They're gonna move two. Let's see, where am I moving around here? You can just go straight ahead if you want to get into our square. Yep, I'm just trying to see if I want to do that. Oh, oh buddy's getting spicy. You should, <laughs> so, you should pay for that activation and then just not move. So <laughs> we're going to go one. Two. I don't think so. We're going to go one. <laughs> two. We are preventing ninjing. And then oh. one. Cool. Very nice. And that's your and then turn? That will be my turn. Strategery. Oh man, I kind of I kind of want to rest, buddy. Oh, I already moved him. There we go. That bone giant's coming up, bud. Did you want to do a swing, Chad? You get your swing. For oh free? yeah, you get your swing. Oh, I would get a single. Why not? Just don't do it. Don't worry about it. A single attack. <laughs> Where is it going? <laughs> what a. You got actually one. you got one active, huh? Yeah. If I get two orange. 
No, no, yeah, that's not what I'm asking. Just yeah. long story short, you have one, and then if you go active, you're gonna get what two gems back? Yep. I'm honestly thinking about resting. I'm gonna have two to. gems back, huh? You know what I'm gonna do instead then, which we'll see if I kick myself in the face. Probably. We're gonna move all the kick skeletons in here, actually. Mm -hmm. Kick yourself in the face. We'll put all four skeletons in there, ladies and gentlemen. That's what we're gonna finally do. Body block! I'm gonna can Super I have an, cool. may I please have an orange? Super cool yourself. Thanks. Um so yeah, we're uh so all four of these uh, skeletons are going to declare Baylet as the attack. As the defender, excuse me. Block! Yeah, no, well, we got we got two guards, so we're going to guard. So, them. guard one is going to take skeleton one, guard two is going to take skeleton two, and then yep. there's going to be two spill-off skeletons. I, I believe we have, do, do you have to declare their attackers all at the same time? Or do you yeah, so then, then, no, because you have to declare your you're blocking before the attack is yeah. even rolled. So. Yeah, so so one so two, goes yep. and then and then you There's, attack. Oh and yeah, that's all the same. Yep. 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 So this is uh the first of four skeletons yep. on and this is a intercepted attack. Yep. Right? Here we go. Okay. Uh Ooh. two damage. He is toast. Unless you oh well, no, he cannot defend, correct? He cannot defend. If he uses his sacrifice ability. No, he can't. Nope, he can't. Oh, I guess that's on. He is. He is. Oh, I'm, I get what you're saying. He yeah, is that's a dead good. dude. Okay. Yeah, he's dead. Next one. So, boom. He's out of there. Don't okay. Worry. And then here's uh, second skeleton. Um, Nothing. So then the other two on Baylor. Well, can I... Well, then you declare the next one, and then I can block, right? Or is that not... Is oh, that, is that the question? I don't know if that's your... Yeah, absolutely, you could do that. Okay, yeah. okay. Well, the logo. Uh, third, uh, and then fourth. Mm -hmm. uh, oh, he's toast. Two. So... Well, hey, dude, he soaked up all four attacks, so... Well, it's better than the nothing he was going to do, though. Yeah. That's a big oh, swing. True. How many cubes uh, he got? Nothing? Nothing. All right. Uh, so the start of turn five. So, active or not... <laughs> So you you just, just just to go over, yeah, no, someone know. needs by turn seven, whoever has the skull must get yep. on the stairwell. Yeah, yep. just making sure that... Okay. Yeah, yep. well, we're... Tell that we need to kill these dudes. I know. Do you have that bone golem up next turn? All right, fine. No. Could, um, could. Yes. You have one activation. Could. Yeah. I'm going to do... I'll stay active. You're I staying guess. active, guys? You have to kill those guys. Uh, I can't spend... i got to at least save one for an armor against that bone so i'm thinking two into them yeah, you guys got a tough turn here this is a big one what do you think two yeah he doesn't have any cubes left get him oh okay three <laughs> well he's gonna get some but yeah so i get two red or no i get three red and an orange god this might be overkill yeah, I, th armor. I think this is overkill. Okay, so thought he does have a zero armor. Yeah, he's got zero armor. Yeah, and we're just gonna do two. So two energy. red, an orange, and a free reroll. Here we go. Uh, they are dead. They are all Slaughtered. dead. Hack, 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 hack. That's why okay. We, that's why we brought you. <laughs> Ryan's just here for this balloon. So here's the real question: We get movement right now. Mm -hmm. We need to go in that room. He's going to bring more dudes back. Which room? The room with them? I think they might be in trouble, Chad. It's way out. Got to be honest. You feeling optimistic? It'll depend next turn. Currently, yes, but it's. Uh, I think everything's in flux for a turn. Mm -hmm. And then I think, yeah. Then I think we'll be able to kind of see the writing on the wall. When we're there. Do you want to walk into that square? Dude, dude you walk... walk I could put some dice into it. How much armor does that thing have? Uh, two armor on the bone golem. Dude, I'm going. So my active for my movement, I'll go one, two. Put me in there too, so you can I was re just, just gonna ask if Bailey will be joining. Oh, of course. Yeah, I figured as much. <coughs> I, need to, then, I need to join my champion. We gotta use it. Um, can that thing bodyguard, by the way? That little skeleton no. dude? Yes, okay. the skeletons have literally no rules. So, so I'm going to spend one into the attack. So and if, then, you, if you attack the skeleton, don't you overkill into the bone golem? Oh, I sure do. Fair. Yeah, okay, so kill, spend... the, kill the skeleton so we can't bring any more back. Okay, we'll do that. Yeah. And then do I want to spend this to get an extra red? Or I could spend this and then get a whole second red and orange. 
on the golem. Um, that seems decisions. that seems better. Okay. Getting so we'll do this is a, just base attack. I put one into my attack. Here we go. And again, it's the skelly. Yep. Oh, boom! Uh, I, no, we're gonna keep it. You keep Four. That. So three overkill, mm -hmm. which just does one, one damage. damage. Yep. So the skelly. Uh, he's gone. <laughs> and then we'll use my momentum, and we'll do uh, another attack of the same, basically. Another roll. Oh man. Boom! Oh, three damage. Dude! Total. Three damage off that, huh? Are you going to sink it in, bud? R Jesse, that was <laughs> vicious. That was, that was gross. That was, there was a time to roll good. Wait, that I can't do it. that many. I can only do two, right? Uh, yes. I can only exert two? Yep. Okay. Oh, four. So two more. There it is. Yeah, he's dead. I oh, think the uh, I think that's gonna be uh, the yeah. mission. Uh, you uh, end of my turn. You can uh, try to spear. They do have to get to the end, actually. So yeah. we need to go. Yeah. 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 He's gonna try. End, end of five. Yeah. yeah. Right. Um, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pull three cube. Oh, first of all, I refresh. I'm gonna pull three cubes out. Yep. It's time to get speared, you guys. Oh, excuse me. I'll pull four <laughs> cubes out. This guy goes away, though. This guys, you're about to get speared many times. Two times. I'm gonna get speared. Conan's gonna get speared. I don't know. Uh, I don't know what he's gonna so do. So, pay one. <laughs> um, <laughs> technically. <laughs> yeah. Um, and then yeah, we'll. Um, technically, probably doesn't matter. Realistically, um, but for what it's worth, I'll attack Conan. Cool. Uh, for four. Oh, okay. oh. man. Cool. Ouch. Okay. Uh, and then activating my second one. And then same kind of deal. Uh, oh. We'll keep for three. Three okay. more. Just and then that is immediately the end of my turn. So okay. Yeah, I, was, I, was, I was wondering if you could activate them multiple times. I don't think you He only gets two activations. I, yeah, I only get to activate two tiles ever. All right, Unless, let's go. Uh, yeah. Cool. Uh, I will activate. I'm going to spend all my movement just to do it. And boop, 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 boop. there you go. All right. That's it. The heroes have won the game. Uh, that was a good game, gentlemen. Why don't we stay, uh, stay tuned and please like and subscribe. Um, we really appreciate it. We appreciate the support. Uh, we want to bring you more quality content, more Conan, more Lord of the Rings, more Marvel Champions, and any other board game you can imagine. So once again, hit that like button, like button and the subscribe button and stay tuned for the after show. Thanks, guys.